Ah, cool. So you see with this camera, I'll be able to zoom in and show you a few little features on the saw that we're going to use there. And we can actually have a look at, uh, at things. So with your traditional mitre, for example, this is just a normal uh, flat frame and it's got a little bit of a texture running through it. But when it's joined, it basically looks like um, just this little, this little sort of uh, flat molding with a slight bevel leading on into the saw the itself. Normally when you're going to put a, a piece of wood into this saw to cut, you're going to stick the timber in and it's going to be flat and you would set this saw up out of the way first of all and you'd lock it in here on your 45 degree angle. So we're still using uh, the, the 45 setting today. We're not, the compound mitering, we are not doing multi-angles, which this saw has presets for multi-angles, but we're actually using the 45 degree setting. And this, we've got a lot of light glare coming off the, uh, the spotlights in here that we've got lighting up the scene. So this one here is our compound angle. And this one here is our normal angle. And yeah, you can see there on the back. So basically, if I put them back to back, normally you'd expect the two pieces to sit together. So this sort of is cut on a chamfer down this way. And this one's just cut on the 90 degrees. Now the thing is there, and what I've done, I have actually cut, I have cut some other pieces. Let me just stand this up again for a sec. I have actually cut that join to get it looking really good. So it's a little bit like having a flexible fence on your um, V-nailing machine, except what we've done is we've got the, the flexible uh, fence just made out of a piece of timber. So in this case, I'll actually V-nail this. I'll try and V-nail it from the back and I'm just gonna use a hammer to do it. So nothing fancy. Um, you could drive it in with some of the V-nail tools that are out there. That'd be right. Get a little bit of glue out of our, our nozzle here. We'd be able to put some, this is just PVA glue. We use different types of glue for different frames. We've just found the, the high solids PVA is good. So a bit of glue on the join. Again, you could apply glue to all surfaces. I'm just gonna glue up the two ends of the shorts in this case. So, a little bit of glue on the end of the mitres, 